Hello and welcome back for another Plan With Me video. Today I have a really cute spread to share with you. This was my spread from last week and I used the Panda Bird Design Kit. It was called Joy and I really love how that turned out. It was really pretty like pastel-y and I just think it was so nice. So for this week from the 13th to the 19th I'm going to be using a Valentine kit and this is from Stick With Me Shop. I had pre-ordered this kit. So here's the freebie that came with it. And I believe this was called Better Together, and I did get the deluxe kit, so it came with the week trackers, and I think it also came with an extra um, half box sheet. So these are the stickers that I'm going to be using for this week. I also pulled in these glitter headers. This is from Panda Bird Design, and I'm going to use this ready pink color and also this light pink color. And then for the washi tapes for the bottom, I'm using these two washi tapes that came in a kit in a little tube from Michaels, and it was the Valentine one just that was recently released. So I'm using that Happy Valentine's with the gold foiling and that painted brush stroke type of washi. And these are my clips for this week. These are all available in my Etsy shop, and I showed these last week. These are the glittery crocheted hearts and bows. And then this is this week's new release, and I am so excited about this. It is a custom clip, so you can get your name put on it. And I stamped and Copic colored these, and they are nice and sturdy. The back has cardstock on it. It comes on a gold paper clip, and I'm so excited about those. It's so adorable. So if you did want one of those, I will link below my Etsy shop. You can use the coupon code CRAFTYGIRL, and you can also choose if you wanted to have your paper clip a different color since it's custom. I did mine pink, but if you want to put in the description box what your name is, and if you want to put that you want a blue um, banner, or if you want green or yellow or whatever color you want, you can leave that in the description box of my Etsy shop um, on the little comment section when you check out and I will be sure to make it all cute and custom for you. So I'm just putting down the washi here. I love that watercolored one and this one with the foiling that says happy Valentine's Day and I just love that it matched the kit so perfectly. So I'm just putting that down and using my Erin Condren ruler to rip it off and then this kit came with date covers. They are so cute and I actually had also ordered the sheet that came with the little date covers that are like a Valentine countdown but I put those on my monthly spread but they do match. They're so adorable. Now I'm going to do the sidebar so I'm just going to use the full box that says we belong together with those cute little puzzle pieces. And then I'm going to take that watercolor washi and I'm just putting some of it down and because the I want it to line up with the half boxes. I'm just putting it down and then once I put the half box down then I'll rip it off and I didn't push down the bottom yet because I want to be able to tuck that washi in there. And I really had trouble with it. I was totally fussing around with it and now I just ripped it off on either side because that was easier. Then I'm going to take one of the weekly trackers and there's a little tiny chocolate cutie with a bow on and she's just so adorable this kit is just perfection so I put that down and then I wanted to for the thankful thought part at the top I just left it because it matched and I just added some deco stickers there to decorate it and I have been adding a thankful thought each week so I did want to leave a little bit of space to add that in I'm putting down some more of that washi and then I'm going to put down the other date tracker and I used the first one for my dinners, and to be honest, I don't know what I'm going to use the second one for. It's um, partway through the week, and I haven't written anything in it while I'm like as I'm voicing this over the week's part done. But um, I will probably go back and add in maybe what happened each day of the week or something like that. So I always like my bottom to match the washi that goes across, so I just added that in there. Now I'm going to add in the to-do labels and also the little checklist that came with the kit. And then I'm going to take some of the glitter headers and um, I kind of do a pattern with it. So I go back and forth. So each week the to-do was on a different spot of the layout and also the glittery headers across don't um, have two corresponding days the same. So I'm just adding them in with my little pattern there. And those glitter headers are so beautiful. So I pretty much have the base of um, this week. And then I'm just putting in one of those little Stick With Me shop stickers. And it was a little shopping bear. And I put that I needed to go to Staples to pick up some supplies. I also took from 
Bunny Studio Co., I believe. I took that little tiny um, quarter box. It was glittery. It came on a freebie sheet and from Joy of Planning, I took that little Dr. Bunny, which is so adorable. I will link all of the shops below um, for the stickers that I used. I put that little bunny and he is so incredibly cute. So I'm just writing down doctor's appointment. And then I also wrote down that I had some clips to finish for my Etsy shop and I also had some orders to pack. I also went to Michael's this day after the doctor's appointment. My husband took me to Michael's, which was so exciting. Um, I hate going to doctor's appointments so much. So I was really excited that we went to Michael's and I picked up some new goodies. And then I'm just writing over here dinners and I like to add little dots or dashes underneath my words. I think it just adds a little something. So I just put down, um, when I had done this, it was already Wednesday, so I just wrote down the meals that we had for the first half of the week. And I put that little cute grocery bunny, which was from Joy, or Bunny Sticker Co. And then from Abundance of Erica, which is now called the Sticker Party, I put down this Bachelor Sticker. These are so incredibly cute. And she has new stickers that came out for Survivor, and she has self-drawn the pictures of the images of all the characters who are going to be on this season. So I'm so excited to use those. I already have them and I'm like eagerly waiting for Survivor to start. So I put down that little flag and some deco there. And then I just put down McDonald's because my husband treated me to some McDonald's breakfast this day after my doctor's appointment. I always like to get McDonald's for a treat. So I was totally spoiled this day. And then I put down that half box and a little candle just to put that when I got home, I was just going to rest and relax. It was a long morning. And so I was happy to get home and just have a restful afternoon and evening. And then I add in some dashes there at the bottom. Then for Tuesday, I'm going to put in a little bunting flag there because this was Valentine's Day and I was so excited to decorate this cute day. So I actually lift it back up. I also lift up the little Michaels bag there and I forgot to say the Michaels bag is from the Coffee Monsters Co. They are so adorable. Nothing is more exciting than going to Michaels, but when you have a sticker to document it in your planner, it makes it more fun. So I just put down those little check boxes and then I'm just putting down the other full boxes there. And then I'm just writing down Happy Valentine's Day. And there is actually a new kit from Stick With Me Shop. It is a Sticker Lovers Addict kit and it's like teals and purples and I did pre-order that and it's on the way and I will definitely be doing a plan with me using that one and I believe she has another pre-order going up if you follow her on Instagram. She's going to announce when the next restock of it's going to be so if you did want to get one of her kits the best way to do it is to follow her on Instagram because she has like specific times that she posts them. So I put down that cute little bear with the little exclamation mark and another little bunting flag or little banner. And then I'm just putting down that cute little candle. And I actually ended up taking it up and using from this, um, this cute little bunny here. I wanted to use the deco that I got. It was a freebie for Valentine's Day. So I put that little cutie there. And then at the bottom, I put the little bunny who got flowers. My husband bought me the cutest. Um, it's like a flower pot that you get to keep and it is like pink with hearts on it and it has like a rhinestone heart on the front it's so pretty and it had pink flowers in it so I wanted to put that little bunny there who was getting flowers I thought that was so cute then I'm just writing in some of my to-dos and the pen that I'm using is from Michaels it's the Recollections Ebony Black pen and I love it so much and I'm just putting my husband had a dentist appointment and I didn't want to forget about it And I love how much deco you get in this kit. And I used this really cute little phone sticker from Once More With Love. My dad had called me this day and we talked on the phone for quite a while. So I was super excited to document that in my planner. And I put that little cute munchkin on the phone and she has a little pink phone there. 
And then from Abundance of Erica, I'm just taking one of those little envelopes and her shop now is called The Sticker Party. I just put ahead some Etsy orders to pack. And then I had this little cute dishwashing bunny. Then I'm gonna take that little munchkin. She is from Once More With Love and she has glittery washi tape. So I just put down that I was going to film my design team project for Not Too Shabby for this week. And then I put those two little hearts from the deco sheet almost to make a little to-do list. So I put that I had to voice over and edit and upload my video. I'm just putting one of those flags down and my husband had soccer this day. So I put down a little soccer ball. It is from um, Happy Cutie Studio. And my husband actually hurt his um, knee at soccer this day. So he was actually home from work this day because he was hurt. And so I put down also um, at the top here a little half box. I wanted to put that I was going to be spending the day with him. And so I have a little flag here. I put a little coffee for the morning. And then I put this little half box just so that I could put that I was spending the day with my husband. And it probably should have went after the um, soccer sticker, but it I was just trying to fit it in, and so that's where it fit in. And then I'm just adding in the little numbers for the date. Then I get started on Thursday, and I'm basically going to do the same thing I did with the other side. I'm going to put all the little to-dos in and also the glitter headers. So I'm going to continue on with the same little pattern that I did on the other side. And this just makes it easier too for putting it all down. I love the glitter headers. They just add so much to the layout. And um, last week I did a no white space plan with me. And this week I have lots of white space and I'm really enjoyed doing this week. I did like it a lot with the white space and I know I mentioned it in last week's video. My type of planning style is that I just like to do all types. Everyone has their own style but for me I really enjoy just kind of doing a mixture and going back and forth to different types of layouts. I think it depends on which kit I use, how many stickers come in. It de depends kind of what type of layout I do. So I'm just adding in all of the full boxes there and they're so adorable. They all have their little mates with them. Their little matching um, together person. And then I'm just putting it in these little checklists. And the little weekend banner fits there so perfectly. It looks absolutely adorable. I'm taking that little sleep in sticker that was on the, the freebie and I just put a little swirly arrow and put do it because I definitely want to make sure that I sleep in this day. And I actually did sleep in so that was good. I actually followed my to-do list. I put that other little flag and this really cute little payday bunny. And I love that little bow that's on the little flags there. It's so cute. Then I'm gonna take from the Coffee Monster Co. one of those little pencils and each week I put in when I post my design team project for Not Too Shabby. So I like to keep track that I'm doing a post each week. So I put that in and I use the pink sparkly pencil. I'm gonna have to order some more of those. They're so adorable. And then I just put that I was going to post my design team project and post on Instagram. And then I'm just taking that little half box there and layering it up with this little munchkin, which is from Once More With Love. And I just put film plan with me and added some little dots. I thought that looked so cute. And then I put a little heart there from the deco sheet. Then I wanted to add in something there underneath the little pencil. So I put the little YouTube binge sticker from the freebie and a little flag and just put that I wanted to catch up on my 
YouTube videos and I did that in the evening. There was, whenever I see YouTube videos in the subscription list, I put them all in like a little playlist to watch later and I just have so many of them to catch up on. So I did catch up on quite a few of them. And then I remembered I forgot to put my dog Diego. It was his birthday on Wednesday, which was super exciting. So I went back and put that in there with that little bunny sticker. I used that little mailing sticker and the little car. The car is from Happy Cutie Studio. And I had a ton of errands to do Thursday, so I just put that on there. Then I knew Friday was going to be a lazy day, so I used that Stick With Me Shop Lazy Day sticker. And I put that little koala bear with the coffee, which was from Happy Cutie Studio. From Coffee Monsters Co., I'm putting this little munchkin because I had a lot of editing to do for my plan with me, so I put that little guy there. He's so cute. And then I also had some laundry to do, and so I just put one of these little laundry stickers. That was um, a sheet from my Etsy shop. It was um, an oopsie sheet that I had, so I just used that little cutie. And then I put down a half box and I knew I wanted to catch up on some shows this day. So I'm using that little cutie from Once More With Love and just adding in some deco. Then from the Coffee Monster Co, I used this little quarter box and put down post my new releases. And I am so excited about this week's releases with the little lamb and bunny. And I thought I would share it early so that those of you who want to get it for Easter spreads will be able to have it made and shipped to you before Easter would come. I just thought that the little lamb and bunny are like the cutest thing ever. So I was so excited. And then I just put sleep in there. And then I'm just adding on some of my to-dos. And then I took that little Instagram sticker, which is from Coffee Monsters Co. And that little um, cutie munchkin who was on the computer there. And then I took a little half box and a little sticker from Once More With Love to put down that I was going to post my plan with me. And then from Happy Cutie Studio, I put down that little cleaning bucket and also the little towel um, washing because I wanted to clean the bathrooms this day. And then I also wanted to wash towels. And then I took this little bow marquee, which is from my Etsy shop, and I'm just putting it there because I know my husband and I will probably be watching movies this weekend, and I put that cute little Netflix bunny sticker. I also added that cute little pot because I was going to be making meatballs this day, and that sticker is from Happy Cutie Studio. So I'm just adding in my clips. Thank you, as always, so much to you guys for watching. Don't forget, if you are interested, that you can head over to my Etsy shop to get these clips that I make. And I'm just showing all of the things that I had left over. And I hope that you guys will leave comments. I love to hear your comments. And if you haven't, please subscribe for more videos like this. And I will see you guys in the next one. Bye now.